Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Dragon Age Origins. We are about to head into the Mage Tower, hopefully. I forgot how loud Shell is. Okay. We got the girl squad. I actually never have brought Shell with me to the Mage Tower, so this is probably gonna be very interesting. Hello, Carol. You. You're not looking to get across to the tower, are you? Because I have strict Whoa. orders not to let anyone pass. I'm a Grey Warden. I seek the assistance of mages. Oh, you're a Grey Warden, are you? Prove it. Uh, prove it? Kill some darkspawn. Come on, let's what? see some righteous <laughs> Grey Wardening. Grey Wardening isn't something you do, it's what you are. Ugh, <sighs> semantics. All right, that's enough. Let me crush a few body parts it can't possibly <laughs> miss. I'll take you right now. Oh, what? Like you wanted. <laughs> Shell! <laughs> yes, please do. Come along, I suppose. I'm glad we brought Shell. Is she going to be able to fit on the boat? I see there used to be a bridge here, but I guess time has, like, worn it out. Or maybe they broke it on purpose. The mystical mage tower. And I want two men stationed within sight of the doors at all times. Do not open the doors without my express consent. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Now we wait and pray. Hello. You're Gregor, I assume? Who are you? I explicitly told Carol not to bring anyone across the lake. Well, yeah. <sighs> Did it tell him not to go insane? Because he doesn't seem to listen well. We're dealing with a very <laughs> delicate situation. You must leave for your own safety. But I seek the mage's help to defeat the dark spawn. I am weary of the Grey Warden's ceaseless need for men to fight the dark spawn, but it is their right. You'll find no allies here. The Templars can spare no men, and the mages are indisposed. I shall speak plainly. The tower is no longer under our control. Abominations and demons stalk the tower's halls. The circle is lost. The tower has fallen. Well, how did this happen? We don't know. We saw only demons, hunting Templars and mages alike. I realized we could not defeat them and told my men to flee. For all your bluster, you Templars are just cowards. <laughs> they took us by surprise. We were prepared for one or two abominations. Not the horde that fell upon us. No, oh, wow. So they're only prepared for at least a few abominations, not a whole pack of them? Do they never think that they would ever face a whole pack of demons? And you're still waiting here? Isn't that dangerous? Or why don't you rally your men and kill them all? I will destroy the tower, raise it to the ground. But I cannot risk more of my men. The doors remain shut, and they will protect us for now. You shut everyone in there, including innocent mages? Not just mages, but my Templars also. Oh! I had no choice. The abominations must be contained at all costs. We do not mean for the doors to stay closed forever. Everything in the tower must be eliminated. I have sent word to Denerim calling for reinforcements and the right of annulment. The right of annulment? The right of annulment gives Templars the authority to neutralize the mage circle. Completely. What the fuck? This situation is dire. There is no alternative. Everything in the tower must be destroyed so it can be made safe again. That's fucked up. The mages are not defenseless. Some must still be. Uh, some must still live. If any are still alive, the Maker himself has shielded them. No one could have survived those monstrous creatures. It is too painful to hope for survivors and find nothing. Uh huh. That sounds like a whiner talking. A quitter. But it was you that shut them all in, literally.
And what was I to do? Leave the door open as the abominations poured out? The mages are lost. It is something we must accept. He's so adamant that they are. Message. It cannot be much longer. There's still so much going on that's unexplained. I too would like to know how this started. I will investigate the tower and see what can be done. You must face and slaughter the abominations to get to the bottom of this. Are you sure you can handle them? No, but we're gonna do it. <laughs> I should consider this more carefully. Abominations cannot stand against me, or I have confidence in my abilities. If you succeed, I would owe you much, enough that I would pledge my Templars to your cause. Without word from Denerim, I must determine our course. Surely destroying Darkspawn is a worthy goal. Yeah. We have an agreement then. A word of caution. Once you cross that threshold, there is no turning back. The great doors must remain barred. I will open them for no one until I have proof that it is safe. I will only believe it is over if the first enchanter stands before the me first and tells enchanter. me it is so. If Irving has fallen, then the circle is lost. That's kind of fucked up. May Andraste lend you her courage. I don't need Whatever that. you decide. Thanks. That's kind of fucked up, but like, if... Every if anyone but Irving stands before him, then the circle is lost. Like, what if they're like children or something that survived? First Enchanter Irving, there is no higher office in the circle tower than that of First Enchanter. The one who holds this title must not only be able an able administrator, administrator, but also a mentor, leader, and surrogate parent to all the mages of the tower. A parent, huh? Irving has proven himself to be all of these things with an added dose of cunning. Most of princesses know that. Little goes on in the tower that Irving does not know. He can soothe Templars angered by some childish magical prank at the same time that he lands the planksters, and everyone walks away satisfied. And then Knight Commander Gregor. <clears throat> it is the innocent folk of Ferelden who matter. I may I would lay down my life and the life of any mage to protect them. Grim and Tacturn. Tac What? That word is, does not look spelled right to me. Gregor has been Knight Commander of the Templar Forces, stationed at the Circle Tower for so many years that hardly anyone expect, except the first enchanter calls that he is not simply part of the tower itself. <laughs> so we have to help the mages. <laughs> well, why is she laughing? Resorting to petty thievery. No! Oh, sad. Yeah, very I sad. Make it. Is it because she's not invisible? I wonder. A solid. Oh, I should have gave that to Stin! It's two handed, isn't it? I can't even wear it. It's restriction Stin! No. Yes. I wish this were over. We're running low on supplies, and I don't know how much longer we'll last. You have supplies for sale? Yes. Would you like to trade? Yes. I would love to trade. I need, I need all the help I can get. Not gonna lie, this one's probably gonna be very rough for us. It's probably gonna be very rough for us.
Uh, not alphabetically type. Um, wow. Wow, we have so many. Um, I can't change party in here. Shit. Um, can I talk to you? Yes, was there something else you wanted? I have a few other questions. The tower has been quiet for a while. I suppose I have time to answer your questions. How did you become a Templar? Oh, didn't click it. My history does not concern you. I am sure you have better things to do than pry into someone else's personal life. Wow. The Templars of the Dock seem a little odd. Carol. He's generally a good lad, but a little strange, yes. He should probably be in Denerim, but I could spare no one else. He should probably be in dinner. <laughs> okay, do you, don't you feel guilty about wanting to slaughter everything? Do not misunderstand. I do not want to do this. I do, however, see that the right of annulment may be necessary. An unprepared village or town would be devastated should even one abomination chance upon it. We cannot allow it. And the mages, if any live, I do not know what they may have become. We may have to kill them to be certain. Okay. Can I step out for one moment? Because I need to get rid of some things. BRB. Just BRB real quick. <laughs> His Asala, is it? You know, I kind of wish we had a party chest here in camp. You and your friends are formidable folk, indeed. I'm I think I'm going to get rid of this stuff. And if we need to, we'll just buy it back. Which it probably s buys back for like way more than it sells. Like that 16, Jesus. Is this a bow? I want to save this for uh, Liliana. She needs 24 dexterity. I'm probably never going to wear this. And then like all this Maybe we should get rid of some gifts, but I feel like that would move along people's uh, friendship before I'm ready. You know what I mean? We should also definitely... Can I not do that here? Okay, let's go back. I think we've done what we could. Indeed, indeed. Yes. Maker, of course.
We actually have so many more, um... Marion potions now. Wait. Honestly, we're probably not going to keep more again once we get someone from inside the tower. What shall I do? All right, I say we go in. They should keep all flesh creatures in confinement, not just the mages. <laughs> Shell. Making a save. And we're actually, I'm going to make a hard save because this area is probably going to be really tough. All right. Oh. Why is Shell not with us? It doesn't show it doesn't show show Shell in the cutscenes. Wow. Footlocker. Watch guard of the reaching. No 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 and stop asking. I'm not getting in trouble because of you again. I don't care what's in the basement and neither do the senior magi. Everything is about older in the upper floors. I don't know what you're digging up, but those tomes are way older than our lesson texts. An apprentice shouldn't touch them. The threads burned at before a giant. Spear rays. His hands he stands alone, so whispers are known false. Nolan, scribbled in corner. Don't need him. Owen knew reaching. What? We have so many quests. The chaos in the tower has allowed an apprentice to stumble across something ancient and hidden. Find all of his notes to reveal a possible secret in the tower. It's a lot, so... Your command? Pile of filth? This is really fucked up. So I see you are quite the little deceiver after all. Finally decided to go Whoa. to you. It simply suits my view of the Chantry that one of their devoted sisters should turn out to be so full of hypocrisy. There are good people in the Chantry. Many good people who are just there to help others. And apparently at least a few who are simply pretending to be good. At least I was trying to be better than I was. At least, I regretted the evil I'd done. Better that than be someone who's never loved anyone or anything, Whoa. least of all herself. Anything but that. It seems at least you got the self-righteousness down, Pat. Well done. Oh my god. The girls are fighting in the maid shower? On it. Okay, we found more pages. They read this one. I'm telling you guys, it's a test like the summoning. Why else would lessons be canceled? And that outburst in the library with Uldred? An older tome fell to a page on the reaching. I copied what I could before they pushed us out. A sword lowered to strike through at the end ground. You can't tell me I wasn't supposed to see that. It's too convenient. I'm looking for more in your, and you'd be smart to help. Gant. Would we? Allow me. I could do that for you. What are these apprentices doing? Do they not realize what was happening? The spot. Makers win, Darcy. I said I wait, but it's not just a disagreement. Ultra set abominations loose. One was in my mentor's robe. If you mentor's robe. If you make it here, something in the spot may help you out. No point in hiding from the senior mages now, and don't worry about Dinry's usual fee for moving his bed. He's dead. Oh my god. So they were doing something while shit all while hell all broke loose around them. Okay. It's win. It's you. No, 
Come no further. Grey Warden or no, I will strike you down where you stand. When? What are you doing here? I am a mage of the Circle. More importantly, why are you here? The Templars would not let just anyone by. I came here seeking the aid of the mages. And you were told that the Circle was in no shape to help you, I suppose. So why did the Templars let you in? Do they plan to attack the tower now? Don't worry, the right of annulment has not arrived. <sighs> they sent for it then. I feared they might have. What else could they do? So Gregor thinks the Circle is beyond hope. He probably assumes we are all dead. Yeah? They abandoned us to our fate. But even trapped as we are, we have survived. If they invoke the right, however, we will not be able to stand against them. What happened here? Let it suffice to say that we had something of a revolt on our hands, led by a mage named Aldred. When he returned from the battle at Ostagar, he tried to take over the circle. As you can see, it didn't work out as he had planned. I don't know what became of Aldred, but I am certain all this is his doing. I will not lose the circle to one man's pride and stupidity. Uh, so what do you tend? What do you tend? I erected a barrier over the door leading to the rest of the tower, so nothing from inside could attack the children. You will not be able to enter the tower as long as the barrier holds, but I will dispel it if you join with me to save this circle. But the Templars may attack at any moment. True. We have little time. Once Gregor sees that we have made the tower safe, ah. at least he will tell his men to back down. He is not unreasonable. He said only if he sees the first enchanter standing in front of him. Oh, right here. Literally. <laughs> Gregor will accept it if it is the first enchanter says so. Then our path is laid out before us. We must save Irving. Will the children be safe here? Petra and Kenan will watch them. If we slay all the fiends we encounter on our way, none will get by to threaten the children. I suppose that could work. You want us to assist this preachy schoolmistress? <laughs> To rescue these pathetic excuses for mages, they allow themselves to be corralled like cattle. Allow. Mindless. Now their masters have chosen death for them, and I say, let them have it. She's acting like they allow themselves to be here. The majority of them get taken here, and that's all they know. <laughs> now everyone's as fortunate as Morgan as to have Flemeth as their mother. I love Morgan, but there are some things we do disagree on. <laughs> I made my decision. We will help win. Have it your way. Petra, Kenan, look after the others. I will be back soon. When? Are you sure you're all right? You were so badly hurt earlier. Maybe I should come along. The others need your protection more. I will be all right. Stay here with them. Keep them safe and calm. Try not to throw your back out. When that happens, I usually lay about a young upstart with my staff. <laughs> that keeps the blood flowing and works the kinks out of these old joints. If you are ready, let us go end this. Win is so good. All right, with that though, I'm gonna kick Morgan out. I, I don't know how wise this decision is. But well, that's what we're doing. Um, oh, Morgan disapproves. We just gotta give her some gifts at this point. Whoa! You really don't have a lot of a uh, healer, liberator, controller, glyph of paralysis. Um, I do want her to do the glyph of paralysis. I want to. Uh, ability. She 
doesn't need that. It's visible. Use stone fist. We don't even have group heal. I guess I could do that. I don't like this one. See, I don't want to go through this all on my own. Rejuvenate? What does that do? I wish they would tell us what they do while we're here. Earthquake. I do want her to attack some things. So let's have her do stone fist, and then let's have her no ally. I need to know what these abilities do real quick. Hang on. Revival. Life word. So she's a spirit healer, which is really cool. What do these do? Heroic offense. Grants a bonus to attack. Shifts, shifts an ally and ore that grants deflection, missile deflection. Defense from magic. And then what do these do? Heal, rejuvenate, boost to mana, stamina, regeneration, health regeneration, and then what's this? Mana, stamina for all members. Uh, wrong one. Um, so we have none of those. Okay, so ally, health, 50, usability, was it rejuvenate? Shit, I forgot what it was called. Regeneration? Or health. But for stamina... Rejuvenate. We'll try to save that. I don't know. Also, we need to get... Oh, the thing about... That on. All right, I think we're gonna go forward with this. Hopefully, this won't go so bad. I shall. Oh, someone died.
This might be our uh, group going forward as well. It's done. So, oh, we should also probably see if we got any things for her. Give her a cow. <laughs> um. Oh wait, she already has one. Oh fuck, that's probably better. Sil silver apron. <laughs> Apron, and then we need to put all her shit in order. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. Some stained. Oh, this is like... And she knows this as well, but she can't make these. She needs improved herbalism. No! Your wish. Okay, this is attack. This is attack. This is also attack, but I don't know if we'll use that. Glyph of Paralysis would be good. Rejuvenate. I want to put all the healing up here as well. And then all the buffs. <laughs> This is the problem, isn't it? Healing can go here, actually. That can go there. Let's get all her all her stuff together. <laughs> About being on PC, you have to manually put in every little thing if you want to use it. Oh, don't use that. Oh, how do I make her not? Here, I would rather her... I would rather her use... Why? Why did that happen? No. Oh well. Oh well. I was gonna, I was gonna keep that, but oh well. Hopefully she'll level up as we go along and she can make the higher ones. Okay. I don't oh. suppose this is what you expected the circle to be like, is it? Uh, no, I always thought it would be more orderly. I keep thinking this is our punishment for being mages. That's why the Templars have to... to do away with us. No, don't say that. It's not true. You deserve to live just like anyone else. The swords are like the... the sword of mercy that sent Andraste back to the Maker. Wouldn't it have been better if Andraste hadn't died at all? Andraste only died because of man's foolishness and pride. <laughs> we need to atone for this. Okay. We should let the Templars come. Only then can we be cleansed of our wickedness. Um, if you say so. I will pray. May we abandon our tainted Bro. bodies to find peace with the Maker. Well then. It is good to see that some wardens survived. We are sorry for the loss of your comrades. Loghain is to blame. He betrayed King Kaelin. You heard about Loghain. I would never have imagined the Terran a traitor. Does Wynne know what happened? She was there. How did you find out? Wynne was at Ostagar. Ooh. She told us everything upon her return. But why speak of things past? Be careful in there. And stay safe. Thanks, dude. Look after her, will you? You sound a little worried. I don't know if she's up to this, especially not after... I just worry. Not after what? I was on my way down to the library when I heard screaming. 
and a demon came round the corner. Its eyes were afire with evil. I was certain it was my death come upon me. I think I screamed. I was so afraid. And then Wynne was there, in front of me, shielding me. It was light and fire, oh blood and chaos. When it was over, the demon was dead, but Wynne wasn't moving either. I was so afraid she was gone. She was probably just stunned. As I moved to help her, she stirred and coughed. I don't know what I would have done if she had died for me. She just had the wind knocked out of her then. Just look after her, all right? She might be completely fine, but then again, maybe she didn't come away from that totally unharmed. I'm sure she'll recover. Thank you. And thank you again for helping us. Well then. I think it's time we officially move on. I think we got all our tactics laid out, I hope. I'm probably going to have to fumble around a bit just to get used to win, but we'll see. I'm somewhat amazed at myself for having kept it in place this long. Did it tire you or oh, impressive for an old woman? It made me very weary at times, but I had to stay strong to keep us safe. Be prepared for anything. I do not know what manner of beasts lurk beyond this barrier. Are you ready? I'm ready to destroy the barrier. All right. Be on your guard. All right, let's get to it. Does Wynne have any... I don't think she has any other buffs for us, so we don't have, like, weapons. Yeah, fire weapons, freeze weapons. I might get her the spell whiffs eventually. Your glyph of warding. Ooh. Oh, haste. Haste might be really good. We'll see what we do. She's definitely going to be our healer. Oh, boy. Even the game was like, are you ready? No. I'm not ready. Rage, hunger, desire. Clever? Wow! Oh, they blow up. That's what happens. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> what was that ability- or what was that achievement we just got? Clever. Is that a trap? Did we fucking do that? Oh, uh, Wynn probably did. The glyph. <laughs> I was like, set a trap? What do you mean? Alright, we got some books in the library. Nice. Torn book. This is part of the apprentice exercise book. Summoning sciences. The second half of a torn book. The summoning sigil will ignite upon ritual initiation. If the order is incorrect, the ritual will reset. Okay, we're not going to do these right now. I don't want to do those yet. I would love to just um, get through this first, and then we'll come back and do some side stuff for this area. They just gave us more health potions. You think it's a sign? My god, they're giving me so much health potions that they didn't even use. These dudes died before they could use them. A list of household accounts and expenditures over time useful for merchants in negotiating contracts and wages. Okay. This should be easy enough. What's that? Watch guard of the reaching. Ah, now we have... Uh, this one. First enchanter Dorville fell suddenly to a disease of the lungs. This unfortunate description in the direct line of descent form... From tower founding should be treated as opportunity. The circle reform practices to better address the times. Many rituals remain valuable, but some, the two bells, 
Garnold's Lament, Watchguard of the Reaching, Binford, duh, have little or no meaning in our text. We will move forward as Dorval would have wished and commit these and other ceremonies to the age we have left. With no plan of estate, his belongings have been transferred into the common library for the benefit of all. Excerpt Circle of Magi Declaration. Scribbled in corner, reaching again, and oh, they don't know idiots' wards weaken. Huh. To be honest, that's not the ability I meant to click, but it's definitely the ability I clicked. So much fucking fire. Promises of pride. Whoa. Eldred will show us the way. Finally, recognition with the circle and freedom from the scornful eye of the Templars. We will not be shunned. Be ready. A libertarian, hmm? How'd that work out for you, huh? You were a demon. Is that what you wanted? God. <laughs> Holy hell. Barely keeping the girlies alive. Okay. Oh! Princes are allowed and expected to wifly direct a minor spirit, provided it is within the protective confines of the library. Placement of the shells allows for passive imbo Im oh God, immobilization and the emergency purging of any rogue entity. Take care, this exercise is not to be enacted during maintenance or other disruptions of library structure. The danger presented by an incorrect summoning, particularly exercise three, is extreme. And then we can um, do that later if we want. I'm not gonna worry about it right Let's now. Let's get started. More health potions, because they do know that this shit's rough. This is a rough area to go through. Alright, floor one, done. Floor two, let's go. Owain's room is near here. I hope he's alright. <laughs> he's just standing there. Please refrain from <laughs> going into the stock room. It is a mess, and I've not been able to get it into a state oh, fit to be seen. What are you doing here? I was trying to tidy up, but there was little I could do. What? Aren't you afraid of the abominations? Of course. I am defenseless, and if I ran into one, I would surely perish. I tried to leave when things got quiet. That was when I encountered the barrier. Finding no other way out, I returned to work. <laughs> And people say that golems aren't very lively. <laughs> oh, Wayne, you should have said something. I would have opened the door for you. The stockroom is familiar. I prefer to be here. And he somehow lived without doing uh, no magic, just chilling. I guess that makes him safer because the demons don't want to seek him out. It seems safe enough for now. I would prefer not to die. I would prefer it if the tower returned to the way it was. Perhaps Nial will succeed and save us all. Nial? Nial? What's Nial trying to do? I do not know. But he came here with several others and took the litany of Adrala. But that protects from mind domination. Is blood magic at work here? I do not know. Nial was in the meeting. He would know. Blood magic. I was afraid of this. 
Yeah. How's it? How is it worse? Blood magic could control us too. Who knows what could happen then? Could it control Shale? Meow. The litany will give us a fighting chance against any blood mages we encounter. I wish you luck. Perhaps this will be over soon and things will return to the way they were. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> we got a seal from him. Oh my god, he had lever armor? Why did you have that? Will he talk to us? Please do not draw attention to me. I would like to remain in one piece. You know, fair enough. Fair enough, buddy. I, I will try not to draw attention to you. God, they're all mages. Um, We're going to have some we shouldn't have done this. shouldn't I? Tell me why I should spare your life. Or the people you killed didn't want to die either. I know I have no right to ask for mercy, but I didn't mean for this death and destruction. We were just trying to free ourselves. Aldred told us that the Circo would support Loghain and Loghain would help us be free of the Chantry. A you Loghain again? Like. The Templars were watching. Always watching. What you've done will make things worse for future mages. We thought someone always has to take the first step. Force a change, no matter the cost. Nothing is worth what you've done to this place. And now Aldred's gone mad, and we are scattered, doomed to die at the hands of those who seek to right our wrongs. And all you do is wallow in self-pity, pathetic. What else can I do? I'm trapped here. Can die with dignity. Ugh. She did kill people, but she, oh, she regrets it. But uh, I think Serena would be very disappointed. No, no, please. <laughs> well, I suppose that could have been worse. It could have been worse. It could have been better. The Rose of Orlais it appears to be a book about a woman named Lady Talia Leon and her temptress romance with the arrogant Chevalier Garin. Ooh. A love romance book. I don't know what she expected. More knowledge has fallen into cracks here than some have... Sorry, I'm cutting you off a little bit. I need to know what this says. Today we pass even further, far beyond any reach of man. The inverted glow of the Black Sea was always on the horizon of perception, but a path eludes, as always. Untraveled in memory, living, living or otherwise, there is a pull and whispers abound. Something great is there, and away from this, always in peripheral. And another mind, untethered. Tomorrow I'll reach out with my full attention and try to rescue him from his listing. Can someone else have come this far? The wonders we will share. The vessel at hand, words for another time, drip literal power. Documents of the Reaching, estimated 2nd century ancient. First enchanter appointed watchguard of the Reaching to be held in secret. Reaching, before the circle, someone else in the Fae now want this. Ever known. That's sad. Yeah, that is sad. As you wish. A scroll of banister! New codex. Scrolls of banister. The to align with the power of the fate is but the first of many steps. Further is to align the mind of the fate's rules and find the ties between the realm of dream and the realm of flesh. This is the true power of blood magic. The flesh and the mind is inseparable, and therein lies the power to influence and control minds. Whoa! Control minds. Bell's cash. Did 
we find out something about Bell's cash? Oh, I'll take that. All right, their barrier's gone now. We can move forward. All I gotta say is it's gonna be very dangerous going forward. That's all I gotta say. That glyph of paralysis is really helpful. Thank you, Wynn. Private documents. Blank vellum. A love letter! We did sorry, OM. A delicate matter. Why I'm overjoyed at the prospect of having you, an unwelcome guest requires that you excuse yourself by the postern of my estate to avoid a mark upon our reputations. M. These aren't as spicy as I okay. thought they were, or would be. Wow! areas aren't so bad, but the, fur the further we get, it's going to get worse. This should be easy enough. Chess. I shall. Don't drop nothing. Oh, there's a person. Kick the door open. He just walks out. <laughs> Please don't hurt me. <laughs> I'm no one. I'm not important. I just I don't want to die. Oh my, my God. dude. You're not going to die. Pull yourself together. Thank you. <laughs> uh, I suppose I can breathe easy now. Godwin, mage of the Circle of Ferelden, at your service. Well, that much was obvious. Uh, how did you end up in that closet? There were demons everywhere blocking my exit. I decided that the best thing to do in that situation was to hide and be very, very quiet. Yeah, that's smart. I just smart. really want to be somewhere safe. I think I might stay here for now. Maybe go back into my closet for a little while. I've killed most of the demons you could escape. And go where? The Templars have locked the door. I'm just going to stay here and see what happens. Okay. That's fine, too. Very well. Take care. Thank you again for saving me. May we meet again in happier, less life-threatening times. <laughs> we saved another dude. See, not all is lost. There's plenty of people still alive in here that the Templars just want to fucking kill. This little closet. There must be something left. If we get out, we're gonna need gold. Aldrich said. Aldrich's not here, is he? Keep your mouth shut and we'll be right Ooh. More blood mages going against, um... This should be easy enough. What Aldred wants? Kona called me. My one weakness. But we paralyzed the other one, nice. Wow. They were searching for something here? As you wish.
Yes. Or apprentice notes. Grant Gant, Nolan. At that one. This one? His silver cord transmuted black. Black, there is no wonder this his form shattered. What return was not of the mortal nor native fade? Does an afterthought prove the gods when direct action is long missing? There is no purpose to this beast. Let the strength of the tower wither and the memory pass. The only legacy to be taught. Stay focused within the fade. Whims escape to their own actions. Ritual notes. Sword raised to sever connection. Documents of the reaching is estimated second century ancient. Wait, did we? Cord. Peasant magic. Must know. Can also see. Whispers want. What in the hell are they on about? So the glyph only paralyzes one, it seems like. Or maybe the others just pass their resistance check. Shell, get out of that. Whatever that was. Okay. Guess we're not getting in there. Let me look at some of my inventory that we've been getting. We have a longbow. Also... I know we don't have much, but do you want some of this stuff? <laughs> Give her study level armor. Seems like your mage staff is better. Got some ice arrows. Chantry area of the tower. Coupled statue. Oh, I remember this area actually very well. I think we're about to get our ass beat again. Let's do it. This should be easy enough. A statue of Andraste lays defiled. There's a small glass phylactery in the base, somehow sealed within the otherwise solid stone carving. The area is unnaturally cold. Dark shapes swirl around a slip of paper within the vial. The glass fractures at your touch. All right, let's see if we can do this. If not, we'll come back for sure. Let's get started. Guys. When? Why are you that close? Did he pull you already? Sad. Can we get Liliana to um hit it from the back, possibly? Got it. I think we got it. Please. Ah, uh, she can die. 
Yes, we got the cool animation. <laughs> I'm sorry, Shell. That was pretty good compared to our first time fighting one. On it. Scrap of paper. Oh, that's where that's the first one we done. Binding the first corpse walker. Let the dead no longer serve your whim. Bound by your true name, no mortal hand shall reach you. Cal via Zagat, remnant and perversion of an only son. Death beyond death is no longer your stepping stone through the veil. And Dross, they hold you, demon, and bind your rage for eternity. And then we killed him. So he isn't just binded there, bounded there. Good job, guys. Good job, ladies. Girl squad. Ooh, this looks like a... Oh. I half expected to find him here, but I suppose that's too much to hope for. A little right. bit. The fraternity of ch enchanters. Yeah, we get to learn about the um, political stuff. Another aspect of circle life is the fraternities. <laughs> fraternities, I guess. Like, it's like a college, I guess. <laughs> it's called the College of Magi, so they have fraternities. That's hilarious. When a mage becomes an enchanter, he may ally himself with a fraternity. There are cliques that cross circle boundaries. Mages of common interest and goals who band together ensure that their voice is heard within the College of Magi and Cumberland. The largest fraternities currently are the Loyalists, who advocate loyalty and obedience to the Chantry. The Aquitarians, who advocate temperance and follow a distinct code of conduct which they believe all mages should hold themselves to. The Libertarians, a growing fraternity, publicly maintaining greater power for the circles but secretly advocating a complete split from the Chantry, a dangerous opinion, naturally. The Isolationists, a small group that advocates withdrawal into remote ter territories in order to avoid conflicts with the general populace. The Lucrocians, who maintain that the circle must do what is profitable first and foremost. They prioritize the accumulation of wealth with the gaining of political influence a close second. Hmm. We don't hear much about these, I don't think. I think if I... <laughs> I might be a libertarian. I'm going to be honest. Because I feel like the Chantry... The church should not be over... <laughs> people and their livelihoods. I'm sorry. They shouldn't. So far, an elite alliance between the Loyalists and the Aquitarians have prevented the Libertarians from gaining much headway, but there are signs that the Aquitarians may throw their support in with the Libertarians. If that happens, many mages predict it will come to civil war among those circles. Yeah. Maybe one day. Irving's chest. Sorry, Wynn. Ooh. A heavy warmer bound in black leather. Morgan would want to take a look at this. <laughs> okay. For Morgan, guys. If only we brought her with us. Small painted box. Found in first chanter Ir Irving's office. Okay. And then we have his journal. Irving's mistake. I followed another apprentice through suppose secret maneuvers today and exposed her tendency towards blood magic. The environment of the tower is such that certain modes of thought are encouraged, but both for good, uh, for good and ill. The students think we toy with them. The truth is far more intricate and directed. Deviant traits must be exposed early or the whole of the circle suffers. Aldra has been very helpful in identifying the markers to look for. The skills are misdirection are at misdirection are admirable. I dare say that the apprentices would be shocked at his ability to manipulate them. I must organize a retreat such that the other enchanters could benefit from his skills. So he was like benefiting from Uldred. Uldred was uh, throwing red herrings at him to follow. Yikes. And then Uldred betrayed everyone. Can you open this, Aliana? Thank you. Nothing I can use right now. Scrap of paper. Oh. Circles within circles. Arguments between the various fraternities have become more frequent and heated. I have all alerted the College of Magi in Cumberland that this needs to be addressed in coming debates. My fear relations with the Chantry may distract them. I am confident that I can appease the Equitarians and Loyalists, but the Libertarians are proving dissuasive. Or dis- Divid- What? Divisive? Divisive. <laughs> Are the isolationists even interested in speaking? <laughs> the threat of the blight has actually served some good in unifying us under a common cause, but it does not bode well that any given table in the Great Hall is likely to be ideologically weighted against its neighbor. We could be such a moody bunch starting over our tea. Staring over our tea. 
I can read. Words are okay. All right, so second floor done. Third floor. All right, we made it to the third floor. I don't like this place. I feel like I'm being watched. We might be being watched. Appreciate all the Lyrian potions we're getting. Oh, they're forcing us one direction. Yeah, okay. I saw that happening. Bro, the corpses! Not the demons possessing the dead. Oh, there's still more! Scrolls of Brannister! Hold on! <laughs> Others may speak of the sanctity of the mind. For those who know the true power of the blood, this is foolishness. The mind is no more sacred than the knee, a small toe, or the ear. It is a man's organ of reasoning, nothing more. And true reasoning requires connection to the rhythm of the blood. The tireless pounding of life. Interrupt this. Interpret this. And... Uh, no, is it interrupt? No, it's interrupt this. And even the mind is yours to control. Diagram of blood magic ritual in progress with no notation or description. Oh. What? Can I not move? win Holy hell Arcane horror When get up not fun Careful next time Not fun at all Here I am She got knocked down twice. Oh my god. As you wish. So arcane horrors? Did we get a thing about right. them? We fought one of those before, haven't we? No. No, we have not. Arcane horror. Upon ascending to the second floor of the tower, we were greeted by a gruesome sight. A ragged collection of bones wearing the robes of one of the senior en enchanters. I had known her for years, watched her raise countless apprentices, and now she was a mere puppet for some demon. Oh. Demons, of course, have no form in our world. When they enter either where the veil is particularly thin or through blood magic summoning, they must take possession of a body. When a pride demon takes control of a corpse of a mage, an arcane horror is born. 
Although they appear to be little more than bones, there are fierce creatures. These are fierce creatures possessing not only all the spellcasting abilities of a living mage, but also the capa capacity to heal and even command other animated corpses. So that was a pride demon. Holy shit. We survived. If not a little worse for wear. Alright, we got two statues, three statues here. What does this do? Let me guess. This ends in tragedy. <laughs> okay, Gant, Nolan. I think we've done that. Hastily scribbled. Whispers says Great Hall hidden above us the whole time. The vessel in hand, words from another time, drip little power put on bowl. A sword raised to sever connection, cord cut. A sword lowered to strike through the ground, vile. The threads placed before a warrior's spear raised, shielded from each side, so whisper whispers are known false. Where is this? It whispered order, but not where. It's in my head. Put on bowl, cord cut, vile. Bowl. Is there more to this? Hang on, let me save. And go in the next room. Don't see anything else in here. So. Bowl. As you wish. Oh god, what are we doing? Cord cut. Cord cut. Bile. Where is this? It's in my head. I don't know where this other one is. It's in my head. I don't know. Are they really gonna set traps? Right ahead. Lesser rage demon. I don't see anything else that would help with that ritual over there. Oh. Madness, I doubt blood would be of use to you. It is flowing down the tower steps. Step away from this folly before it consumes us all. Oh. Libertarians didn't want this. I have spoken to him directly. His intentions are what, that we will demand the Templars withdrawal. I don't know that I am willing to follow, but I will be present to hear his argument. Or oh, the loyalist said to stop away. Sorry, libertarian is this one. Look, older will show us the way. Sure he will. Sure he will. This is where it's gonna get a little tricky, guys. Possess Templars. My free XP! There 
Ja. Oh. Okay, what's happening in here? Torn page. Five mages, five pages for mages. Tome Devis v Eternus in Maleficatorum Dragos T Vintum. Oh, uh, uh. that phrase. Speak he the words and brought lie. Speak you the words and sentient answers lie in text ineligible. Here I begin my study, knowing full well it will change the circle forever. Let history mark the date that this work begin. Nine twenty nine dragons, so that when we when new calendars are put to paper, then eight font zero zero is known with with certainty. Fonts. From the months of gods falling to the people through me, enchanter fonts. Okay. On it. Right. Another torn page. Lots of shady stuff going on in the circle, I will admit that. Like, what's happening in here? Okay. 479 sovereigns plus favors, immortality worth every coin, words of creation, proof of maker. No one, must, no one must know until translations are complete. I will have first enchanter the ear kings. I will own kings. Glory everlasting. Enchanter Moldald. Okay. What the hell does this have to do with anything? This should be... Did I get frozen? Yes. Oh, Jesus. Explain me while my bitch Leliana went into the other room. Like, what the hell? Why? Oh my god, can they stop moving? This was one of the fights I was worried about. I'm gonna be fucking honest. Oh my god. Magic the bastards. Why? Why can't you do anything? <gasps> I've also been frozen. Oh, I died. Brother. Oh, 
Oh my god. I actually fell in battle. I'm sorry, Puppo. Ready. Actually, I didn't want that one. That was one of the fights I was worried about, I'm not gonna lie, because all those Templars just doing Let's get started. Doing whatever the fuck they want. Right. But we did it! Let us be off. We did it without fail. I think. Yes. All set. Ooh. Another torn page. Trantor fonts, Moldalt. Uh, those things. Speak he the words and brought lies. Speak you the words and sentient answer lies in. Make her take the vendor a copy of fake. Why didn't I see? It was obvious. Spake? Laughing stock. No one must know. Bay and Jome, I find him. I'll kill him. Whoa. What is this about? Another torn page in here. Notes on a wondrous discovery, a strange script uniformed by steady hand. Yes, one would expect an agent of the Maker to be steady. In fact, it follows all my expectation of the words the Maker would bestow. It is perfect, and once translated, I'll have such fun lording this over, and the chantry worth every bit. Are they, like, trying to copy from the same book that they all got separately? And this one knows Bay and Jom. I'll find them, I'll kill them. This dude knows it's a fake. Interesting. Another torn page. The words elude me, but I will not I'll defy their obstinateness. Worked by the old gods or the maker himself, I will wring the secrets into my hands. I need the essence of the powerful and the pure. And so begins a bloody road, but at the end, godhood, the keys to the black city. So everyone besides this dude knew this was a fake, or didn't know it was a fake. We have a quest? New quest. Several of the circle enchanters were unknowingly studying the same forged tome. Someone named Bea, Bea Jome took advantage of their egos and likely made a tiny profit. Keep an eye out for them. Mm. Gotcha. Ooh, it's even saving your game. Watch for the deep. It's red, it's orange, it means it's tough. Yeah, let's do this. Well, having Wynn there just healing without me having to worry about it usually is so good. Oh! There's a tranquil here. What were they doing to you? As you wish. Light runestone. What were you doing here? It is fortunate that you appeared when you did. What the hell? Right. Statue. <sighs> a low rumble signals signals the lowering of an ancient protection, setting something something is free in the lowest levels of the tower. Oh. Oops. Thank you. That was an uncomfortable experience. Ew. Oh, oh, can we talk about all the fleshy bits that we were seeing now? Like, what is this stuff? Ew. And these poor Tranquil, what are they doing to them? Okay, I'm gonna... Nah, we can do that later. I was gonna say, I'm gonna be a little silly and go down below, but we're not doing that. Um, in case this is a very horrible 
horrible experience. I'm gonna save before we go to the fourth floor. The fleshy bits. Can they stop sounding like it that? It's as if a flesh creature exploded all over the room. Oh. Fascinating. Yeah, it's so fascinating. I've never brought shell here. And why would I? Usually I do shell later. Notice here with the that that the exercise area on the fourth floor shall serve as permanent birthing for the Templar garrison station at the tower. Since facilities that accommodate their particular training raid requirements are already on hand, they will be assuming an even closer watch over circle affairs. Enchanter Bergen's optional weapons training is canceled to further notice. Enchanter Bergen has additionally stepped down from teaching duties. Whoa. Why? Oh. It's really nasty in here. You're right, Shell. What the fuck? <gasps> yes, my love. What do we have in tonight? Roast pork, your favorite, and candied yams. The meal looks sumptuous. You spoil me, my sweet. How fare our children at their lessons? You should ask them yourself. What have you learned, my son? Mother has what me the practicing fuck? my penmanship. She wraps me on the knuckles if my letters are not formed correctly. Yes, it is important for a young man to be able to write. And what about you, my dearest Nissa? Mother is teaching me what the hell? hard. And I helped with supper. Well, it is delicious. Thank you. Isn't this wonderful, husband? Isn't our life perfect? Yes, <laughs> it is all perfect. He just wanted a, hus uh, a family? Hi. Everything is just as you wanted, my knight. Our Why is he shaking? Our this happened. Is more than you hoped for. I can't... <laughs> And hand him, foul demon. Do you hear something, love? It is nothing, my darling. Why is he shaking? What Trust is happening here? I will get it. The children have finished supper. Tuck them into bed while I see who it is. Don't be long. The children will want to kiss you goodnight. I will be but a Jeez. moment, my pet. Oh, how precious. <laughs> You are intruding upon a loving, intimate moment, and uh -huh. I dislike disruptions. There's nothing loving or intimate going on here. I have given him what he always wanted. Where is the harm in that? Well, it ends now. I think we should just kill her. It might kill the, the dude as well, but we're meant to kill all the demons as we go up. What was that? Help! There are bandits at the door. Oh, wow. They're going to murder the children. They will not get past me. Bro. Enemies are oh, okay. I was just like, it's just them two. I can take it. No. Fuck her up. Oh my god, what has stunned me? What is going on? I just want to fight her. Ah! 
frozen? Yeah, I, I saw that happening. Um, Wind could also revive. I hate that it's like this. Like, why? Which I guess is also cool, but also. Where's the one? Cleansing your shit, bro. <laughs> Sit down. Holy hell. Poor dude. Notice a censure in Boris paper with official right looking writing on it. Desire and need. Notice of censure, Templar drash your remarks in front of the recruits are only the la latest in a series of troubling events. I am beginning to suspect that you may not be suited to the devotional requirements of training. Perhaps it is time for a personal evaluation of your career path within the Templars. I will schedule some time after the current deployment to discuss options elsewhere in the organization. <gasps> Assistant to the Knight Commander Gregor. Attendant who? Options. Code for dead end duty on a hedge mage hunt in the Banarn. Was he making, like, weird comments to the mages? It seemed like he just wanted a family. He shouldn't have taken vows that- oh, I talked to Wynn. No, I didn't. We're good. Defender Imperium. The Imperium is little more than a dilapidated old slattern. Crouching in the far north of Thade is drunkly cursing at Passabire to recall her faded beauty. One can see that Merathros was once the center of the world, the vestige of her power and artistry yet stand, but they are buried in layers of filth that the Imperium's decadence had accumulated over the ages. The Magrassi live in elegance and stone towers, literally elevated above the stench of the slaves and peasants below. So they're floating, they have floating buildings. The outskirts of Minarathos are awash in a sea of refugees turned destitute by the never ending war between the Imperium and the Inquinari. And yet the Imperium survives. Whether with sword or magic, Tevinter remains a force to be reckoned with. Minarathos has been besieged by men, by Kornari, by Andrasi herself, and had never fallen. True. It has never fallen creature. Skeleton! The de demons of the Fade are jealous of the living beings they sense from across the Vale. They constantly push against the boundaries of the Fade, and when they finally cross over, they attempt to possess the first living creature they see. They are unable, however, to distinguish that which was once living from that which still is. In fact, a corpse provides an even more tempting target to a weaker demon, as it has no will from which to resist the possession. The demon cannot rationalize why this is so, it only sees a target and grasps at the opportunity. A skeleton exactly that, a corpse animated by a possessing demon. Upon finding itself trapped within a body that cannot sustain it, the demon is driven insane. Oh. It seeks to destroy any life that it encounters, attacking without thought to its own welfare. The exact names given to skeletons of this type vary according to the nature of the demon that possesses it. A feigned skeleton is a skeleton possessed by a hunger demon. Those skeletons devour whatever life they encounter and often possess the ability to drain life, energy, and mana from their victims. Wow with their little fangs. A shambling skeleton is a slower moving skeleton possessed by a sloth demon able to bring entropic powers against its opponents, slowing them and even putting them to sleep. Ugh. More powerful demons have been known to command skeletons, but at that level they are known by other names, Revenants and Arcane Horrors to name two. Ugh. Okay. So we got to witness some skeletons. Sorry, dude, but it seems like you weren't a good guy anyway. We came from that way. What's in here? Hi. A blood mage.
Okay, I guess we're doing this. I need to go after that blood mage. Oh my god. Can we do it? Oh my god. Fuck blood mages. Fuck mages. This should be easy enough. <laughs> mages are so hard to fight. Oh. Oh, I have the utmost sympathy for what happened to your charge, but it is beyond the circle's ability to anticipate every obscure demise that an apprentice might face, especially involving methods outside the already extensive realm of magical study. We simply don't have the room for additional training facilities, and there are concerns about becoming too inclusive that I will not elaborate on. Your request is denied. Oh. Some of these mage fights are so fucking hard. Of course. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Insufficient skill. Your wish. Your yes. wish. Turn that off. really nasty in here, you know? Yeah, we can't go anywhere else. Um... Do you want these? Hmm. <laughs> Got the outfit. better. Ugh. God, she would look so ugly with her hat on.